Man, I don't understand any of this stuff. I don't even know what a sign bowl is. <laughs> it's okay. I'll show you, Poppy. Proposition's not a question, it's a declarative sentence that's false or true, unlike a command. Compound propositions are made from connectors, for example, negation, inverse, or disjunction. Well, negation, conjunction, disjunction, implication, all these fall under logic constructions. It doesn't make sense to forget all these. If you do, you fail and you'll drop this beat. So much to learn, so much to do, so let's learn discrete mathematicus. You'll never know if you don't learn. You'll never shine if you're not stern. Hey now, all of us pal, let's learn some logic. Negation and conjunction is on our topic. Together we will explore examples of discrete propositions. King Shook! Let's talk about negation and conjunction, where P stands for I'm standing by the pool. Negation of the P is not P, so therefore I'm not standing by the pool. How about conjunction? Then we need to. Propositions are P with Q. If Q's have a phone, then compound is. I'm standing by the pool here with my phone. Hey now, this is brought to you by the discrete math mouth crew. We teach you all you need to know about discrete structures. That's all you need to know about foundation logic and proof. So go, go for the moon. This is brought to you by the Discrete Math Mouth Crew. We teach you all you need to know about the discrete structures. And that's all you need to know. about a couple quantifiers ups and down a is red as for all also can be read as for every x and backwards e is red for some taking all this into account let's talk more about quantifiers this is not over just yet this can be clarified bet hey now this is brought to you by the screen math mouth crew we'll teach you all you need to know about the screen structures that's all you need to know about foundation logic and proof. Let's translate some phrases together. Here's a sentence, listen to it very closely. Every student in this class has taken a course in a programming class. For all of X is P of X, where X is students and the P is the course. See that simple? Let's move on. We're nearing the end of this informative song. Hey now, this is brought to you by the Discrete Math Mouth Crew. We teach you all you need to know about the discrete structures. And that's all you need to know about foundation logic and proof. Brought to you by the Discrete Math Mouth Crew. We teach you all you need to know about the discrete structures. And that's all you need to know. Let's talk about inference rules, which are simple phrases that will be used to make hard phrases. <laughs> Basically, an argument is made using inference rules, myself including premises and conclusion. Well, thanks for the lecture, I think I finally got it. I can use logic to build better arguments, which in turn will result in proofs and establishes the truth of the statement. So much I've learned, so much I've seen, I think I'll be acing the final and finally receive an A. Or don't call me Dan Morgan. Hey now, 
song, Dr. Crochet. This song is for you. Thanks for all the good times, educational lectures, and all our A's will unfold. But when you make those decisions, I've been told. Okay, guys, the uh, grades came out for the exam. Did you? Shoot. Shoot, I gotta check that. Hey, guys, I think I just failed my exam. We don't care, dude.